Today we're going to teach you how to stand and sit with a walker. Start by clearing the area around you of any potential tripping hazards, such as a pet or a bag. It is important to have a safe environment when standing or sitting. Do not attempt to stand up by placing both hands on the walker and pulling. Instead, start by placing the walker in front of you. Next, shift your body to the edge of the chair. Now place one hand on the walker for stability. You will not use this hand to pull on the walker and place your other hand on the edge of the seat or on the armrest of the chair. You will use this hand to push you up out of the chair. Slide your non-surgical leg back. You will use this leg to help push you out of the chair. Slide your surgical leg slightly out in front of you. Push up using your arm that is on the chair and using your non-surgical leg. When you come to a standing position, grab the walker with your other hand and bring both feet underneath you. To sit down in the chair, a similar approach should be used. Make your way to the front of the chair. Do not hold on to the walker with both hands and attempt to sit down. This may cause you to fall into the chair or miss the chair completely. Instead, back up until you feel the chair behind your legs. Slide your surgical leg slightly out in front of you to protect it. Leave one hand on the walker for stability and use the other hand to reach back for the edge of the chair or the armrest. As soon as you find the chair with your hand, you can sit down slowly. If possible, it's a good idea to practice these movements with another individual to ensure maximum safety. That individual can stand in front of you and hold on to the front of the walker while you practice standing and sitting.